Okay, so we've got this pretty much where we want it. We're going to go ahead and add some titles. So over here on the left, press the title. You can see now you have the title. I'm going to go ahead and change right here in Title Properties my, oh, my, my Labs Project. Now, I'm going to change the size so I can either click the arrows or I can just drag it. And then if you want to move it, just drag it and move it. So I'm going to keep the color the same, but I want to change the backdrop. So I want a kind of a more of a red color. Okay. So there you go. So now I'm going to have it fade in and fade out okay so now we're gonna customize this a little bit um, I changed my my font there's a, a bunch of different uh, fonts that you can take sure uh, what was going on there um, and then change the size now be careful because the size may have to do with some of the settings you have here so you might just have to go back um, the backdrop or the fill color is this white the stroke is the wrap around you'll see that as soon as I change the backdrop here so I've got it on this red color and now make sure and change the opacity especially if you're going to do a title screen so that it's not always just black. I'm going to press OK. It changes it. Okay, so then I'm going to go ahead and fade in. 0.2. Fade out. 0.2. So one of the things I like over Movie Maker is right here I can preset the size, the, the backdrop, the whole bit. I'm just going to call it uh, white, black, red. And I'm going to add that there. Okay. Okay, next is, where do I want it? If I want it as a title, I'm going to drag it here to my timeline. If I want it as a caption, I'm going to drag it here to where it says drag title here. The next step is, how long do I want it? As you can see, the default is 10 seconds. So I can take this little button here and I can raise it or lower it. So I'm going to go ahead and go back down to six, five and a half, six right there. Okay, so that is six seconds. Same thing with here, but instead of dragging this, I found it easier to, to go down and drag it this way because it, it goes a little less. This seems to go a lot more, uh, a, lot, a lot more of a distance in the video, and this is a little more controllable. Okay, so next is exactly where I want my caption. So if you move this timeline, then you can snap. The caption will snap to it. Then you can make it as long as you want. Again, you can see the duration is right here, so it's 18 seconds. I don't quite want it that long. And now it's 16 seconds. 11 seconds so let's leave it on 11 seconds so the next thing is I want I can put another title or caption within that so that it comes and it shows up at the same time or at a different time so for that I'm just gonna go up and press title again because I want to keep this uh, the way it is and I want to change it to about an ant pile okay so that uh, backdrop doesn't really matter but what I want to do is choose that again so I have my same I want to put it down here and I can move that in just a second but I'm gonna go ahead and drag it down here and I want it to come in right about there 
and again I can change that I'm gonna so you can see it's right there I'm gonna drag that snap and then I want it to come right there so so now as I'm having that I'm gonna press play this comes in oh I gotta I gotta move that so what I want to do is choose it and I want to drag it down here where I want it okay so we're gonna just do that again and it's right there where I want it okay so now I'm gonna drag this down again right here I want to go ahead and, and make sure so it looks like uh, first of all the zoom took effect whereas I where the zoom took effect I don't know why it didn't take effect here but it took effect here because these three are, are zoomed in I, I assume so I'm gonna first thing I'm gonna do is take out the background then I'm gonna change this to 75 and you can see it's still huge I'm gonna put it where I want it right there choosing this down here oh that's way down there seems like okay so I choose this over here and that's got 115 so the zoom took effect but for some reason it it went ahead and and calculated it for me whatever whatever that means so now I'm gonna try it a different way copy and paste that puts it up there I want it down here and let's just see what happens okay so it's exactly it already calculated it and everything no background no nothing because I copied and pasted so um, now I can I can change that to further isolate that getting Okay, so now I've customized that, copied the settings, same size, same place even, and now I just changed the words. Okay, so now we're going to go with a title screen. I'm going to copy, and uh, let's see, I'm going to go to the end of that clip. End of the clip. Okay, so I'm going to change that to the end, and let's see how that looks. Well, I lost my backdrop, so why don't I do that, okay, well, there we go. Okay, so for that matter, I'm going to go ahead and remove this. For that matter, I could have just taken this and put it at the end I, I don't have a backdrop again and that's not even the color so I'm gonna cancel that I'm gonna choose white black and red I've got 115 again so let's see where we're at yep it's already zoomed it so what was the other one 45 okay I want to go ahead and change it to the end. okay so now, I guess if I drop it down here, it's still going to be 10 seconds. So I'm going to take it down. I'm going to choose that. So it's going to take and go over the existing. So I'm going to take that and I'm going to do a half. Okay. There. So I still have my, my images there and there's still a little bit of color to it. Okay, so we're just playing around now. So I'm going to go ahead and, and remove this this one. I'm going to leave this one in. And I'm going to get back to the beginning beginning here. And what, what I'd like to see is this is 115. So as you can see, I zoomed in. But once I get here, 
it's 44.81 because I've zoomed this. If you if you watched my my other video and how I zoomed this, so uh, for some reason it calculated it here, but it didn't calculate it in these other ones. But either way, we got it figured out, and I can just I can just highlight each one individually and change the size and and that sort of thing, even just by using a title uh, a title base. So that's it for now.